So in your day-to-day -day work, do you have a preference of uh, Keras or like PyTorch? The, the funny, I, I think it's very funny. I did most of my PhD with Keras. Mm -hmm. Then in my first job, they really liked PyTorch, and which is, I think, the other way around as people see it, because usually people are like, if you do research, you have to do PyTorch. But like most companies will use TensorFlow anyways. I think if you understand the systems behind um, the models that you implement, if you understand why you're doing these things, it doesn't matter if you write the one flavor or the other. Mm. Like 